All right, set championship, day two, round 10, standard. Once again, forgot to hit record uh, at the start, so I think this is the last time I did that. But uh, we're a few turns into the game. Um, can't really tell. Looks like he probably played first because he's already cast two, three drops. So I think he was probably on the play this game. Couldn't completely swear to it. But I, I think it's from glancing here that seems likely. Although, yeah, I mean, probably. I don't know. But game one, let's start it. Forgot to start again. Opponent mulligan to five, got off to a good start. I had a choice to play this oh, on white. That's right. He did. Blue. I chose white and then I drew white, black, and land. Those are yeah, basically the decisions. He definitely play. played, but he, he got a, a mulligan to five. He definitely he came out he came out job, fast. Please. I'd probably get steamrolled if it if it wasn't a mulligan to five. Typical main differences here. I have four Obscuras. He's got one in Elite, and he's got one Legion Angel in the main. He's got a lull. Some some different stuff. One extra kill spell. All in all, pretty pretty similar. What I expect out of a mirror from, from more standard looking decks. I just really like the Interceptor. It only can't, got boarded out like one match, some of them. So I don't know. No other people I saw just running four of them, but I certainly liked it. I mean, I didn't, I didn't do great in standard, but four and three. I mean, they they seem to be good though. Certainly happy trading off. He doesn't get a 3 3, it's a card. Underdog. I'm gonna cast this thing anyways. I mean, even here, as mopey as it seems, it's pretty damn good. Good Nikaito here. Use for meat hook, a little same shit, and intercept. And I mean, I know he mulligan to five, but that's a game. To five. That's a game I was on the back foot. Even. You know, I know we didn't see the start of it, but he came out. He was the aggressor. I was on the back foot, and I still got good use out of intercept. I, I just I can't stay, say enough how much I've liked it. The game was dicey. I'm gonna trust my notes here on the draw. Even one meat hook, and one verse. I really dislike the meat hook in this matchup, but I, I decided on the draw when they have a bunch of weddings that I can keep one in. Oh, luminarchs could just be worse with draw though. I don't hate playing like one Kaizo on the draw either. I'm going to try it like this. It's definitely one of the ways to do it. It's fine for Ray to keep that planting. And if I don't have the Ray, this sounds a lot worse. I'm going to be far behind. Yeah, I guess I can't really cast a verse if I don't play that land. I could have just went land fast for that underdog though. Oh, I mean, 
now my my mind kind of shifts to like trying to cast that card. I don't know why I killed the wedding right there on my main phase. I didn't even think it was horrible right now, or I didn't even notice it in the game. But boy, was it bad. That was that was the yeah, worst mistake I've seen so here. far, really, I think. That's a head scratcher. Yeah, it doesn't have anything to punish me for waiting. But yeah, that's just awful. I would have had mana up, I could have killed the Rafine. And maybe he doesn't make the same play, but if he does, killing the Rafine, he gets another token. And I can meat hook him. He still has the wedding, but no board. He'll get one 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 that flips into a two two. And I'll still I'll still have my verse. Yeah, that that was horrendous. And I didn't even notice it at the time, or like right when I first did this until. Yeah, I don't know what that was. Hope he doesn't have any sort of counters. That seems like by far my worst play so far. I don't get that one at all. If I draw a land. Untapped land, do I even live? Not if he pitches a couple spells. Or has land for these underdogs. But yeah, I mean, oh, this could have been preventable, honestly. Yeah, I, I just chalked it up to be in on the draw and meeting. a little too clunky, and he, he got right out of the way of that massacre, which happens a lot, I think. But that, that could have just all been prevented. If, if the game, if he would have played the same, which is, it's possible he didn't, but my play was horrible. The play, just on the curb stomp. That's the planet beast. Yeah, I think I just get frustrated when things aren't going my way sometimes. I don't know, especially the early part of the games. Sometimes I'll stay in battle in the end. I'm an old man, I just, I don't know. I need another land. Like, I didn't even notice I got punished when he played Rafine. I just was like, oh, he just, he's got me. So for that. Kaito, massacre for two. Pretty good. Not good for me. Quite bad for me. In fact. Yeah, I mind this when he has a couple of obscures of his own. Well, one in the deck, one in the board. I assume he's, I don't know. He also has disdainful strokes. Maybe he brings those in. Uh, I don't mind doing that. Still gonna be good. 
Yeah, I mean, that's not like a surprise. He didn't pull block yeah, there. He's got to make that double block. That This guy's got vigilance, too. That, that's wild. I'm in a lot worse shape if that happens. But, now, I mean, now I just have a couple of vigilance guys. So it's probably okay for me. Oh boy. Uh, not ideal for not ideal for me there. Interesting spot here. Could minus this emperor and play another one. That's kind of what I like. It's plus it pass seems awful. We could play underdog. Yeah, I like minus emperor minus. He can't just play his own. My guys have Vigilance. I can give a first strike if he plays his own. Get in there. I don't think there's much to do here, but just attack. Uh, that resolves, and I just ray the token is what I should do here. I'm not sure if this is correct. Yeah, I don't like that. I don't really think I like what I do here either. I think I do the underdog and pump the inner side. I, I don't know what I do. Something that that I don't love. I didn't love getting my underdog sniped. Oh, I didn't even do what I thought I was going to do. Never mind. I am doing the underdog though. Why didn't I first strike the interceptor in that case? This doesn't make a lot of sense. It's made about no sense. Maybe I should have put more value on my underdog. Make it 2-2. Two, two. Make it 3-2. Three, three, huh? I mean, that makes less sense than my attack, attack though, I think. Somehow he did, I didn't just exile the underdog. I don't know what I don't know what my play was. Maybe I confused him. I don't know. to pressure the emperor at least a little bit.
No block with the 3-3 three, three kind of surprised me. Doesn't look so good. Obviously get lucky here, but I did remember to cycle first to find this array. So I think I do it. I mean, he's got vigilance for crying out loud. It's a big draw for me. Definitely an important draw. Let's discard at least one spell. Wow, I discard an emperor for that. He has removal for this guy. Probably. Yeah, if I get the underdog back and he kills the interceptor, I'm going to like nine, and then he gets his under underdog and with Rafine and meat hook, I pretty much just die, but we thought I had to go for it. Now I think I make some some two two unblockables. I think I'm mostly thinking if I want to just send this in, way. yeah, I send just to send it in for life, but it didn't seem correct. Uh, obviously people on YouTube, if people watch this, can watch it anytime, whenever, you know, I want to get up while it's as current as possible. I know that not a lot of people are playing these formats. I know the next round is extraordinarily long, and this has taken me many hours today. So I do think I'm going to maybe do a little short stream, a little bit of stream in the night, relax, finish these off finish these off tomorrow but yeah